Hi guys, Jason from Liberty Militia here. So this is the second part video on Jeremy Corbyn. Let's roll the first bit of footage. We have a European bureaucracy totally unaccountable to anybody. Powers have gone from national parliaments. They haven't gone to the European Parliament. They've gone to the Commission and to some extent to the Council of Ministers. These are quite serious matters. So words there from Jeremy Corbyn sounding very Eurosceptic. He has been, he has had a Eurosceptic position through the, nearly all of his political career. Let's cut to a video post-Brexit and see what he has to say there. Did you vote Leave? No, of course I voted Remain. Why do you ask me the question? Another conspiracy theory. Oh, you, you, know. you, you follow too many conspiracy theories. I've just heard people say that you've never been completely unequivocal and that it may be that you secretly voted... I voted for Remain, but I have made and continue to make criticisms of the EU, mm -hmm. the way it's trying to impose a free market across Europe, the way it's trying to impose privatisation on some services, and those are the powers okay, want to get back. Control, can we just go back... What can we just go back do to you so those are the two opinions of Jeremy Corbyn. First video filmed in 1996, second video recently post-Brexit. Do you think Jeremy Corbyn is right to have been a Eurosceptic in the whole of his career, but when it came time to pull the trigger, he voted Remain? In Jeremy Corbyn's head, he must honestly think that if he was PM, he would be able to negotiate a good deal with the EU. I think there's very little evidence of the EU willing to entertain much negotiation, negotiations with the UK at all. It's possible we've had a very, very strong leader, possibly like a Donald Trump or something along those lines, possibly some negotiating on the table, but I think Miss May's too weak, Jeremy Corbyn's definitely too weak and doesn't have the attributes of a, of a leader that could negotiate with the likes of Juncker. What are your thoughts? Do we support Corbyn? Do we boo Corbyn? I'll leave this one up to you guys, but I think there's definitely some questions there over Eurosceptic Corbyn, who when it came time to... When, it, when, when the dice... When the money was on the table, he voted remain. See you in the next video.